Ikea time. Yay. Do you like that too, or do you just like your cracker? Mm. Ew. Clearly. Clearly. Look. <gasps> oh my goodness. Look at that. He's so cute. Oh my goodness. How cute. Oh, let's put him up. Oh. Wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna fight Mark this one. I love this stuff, John. Oh, yeah, the little. Put there. There's the easel we used to have, John. And I think this is pretty cool, but I don't know how much I would use that. gone a week in our 15 foot sunflower Open. has finally opened and my goodness it is beautiful so we got back from Cincinnati about a couple of hours ago and I've gotten most of the stuff put away we didn't have a look we had like one load of dirty clothes left from the trip um, because we did laundry at our friend's house and we did laundry while we were in Cincinnati for all of Lily's stuff. But when we go up, we always try to do a few fun things if we can squeeze them in just to kind of make it where it's not just going up to get um, to do clinical visits and stuff like that. So we always go to two places. One is Jungle Gems and one is Ikea. And the Jungle Gems video um, I will make a separate video of um, and so you'll want to check that out because it's just a really really cool store um, but I was gonna share with you kind of what we got at Ikea I didn't get a ton um, I just since we go kind of every six months or so um, there's just I mean we obviously we just don't need a lot I don't want excess in my house which we already kind of have like more than what we need, obviously. I am not a minimalist. Um, I would love to be, but I'm just not. And so I'm gonna share with you just the, a few little things that I got from Ikea in just a second. One of the things, it's a bookshelf that we got to put in our living room on a wall that has um, some bare space on it that I've been wanting to kind of add to. And we have an overflow and overabundance of books like I'm sure most other homeschooling families have and most book loving families have so I found this really great bookshelf um, actually I found it because our friends that we went to visit asked us to pick up a couple for them and I was like mmm $19.99 that's just too good in of a deal and we need it anyway to fill up that space so um, anyway so I will turn the camera around and let you see what we got so it's just real simple like I said I didn't get a ton of stuff um these are those tempered glass plates um like the Corel plates um I have some really nice stoneware plates that I well they're not really not nice anymore because they're 11 years old over 11 years old but 
I've been wanting to get, uh-oh, it got dirty from the back seat of the van. Um, I've been wanting to get just some Corel type plates, just the tempered glass plates that don't break super easy, but that clean off really, really easy. Ikea had these for only 79 cents each. And so I got eight of those. And then we got eight of the bowls. They had more of like a cereal bowl style, but we thought these would be really great for things like pasta or when we have Petros for dinner or our lo mein, just anything that we needed kind of a bowl, but we don't want it super deep. So we got eight of those. Again, those were only 79 cents. That was a great deal. Okay, so I wanted a few little decorative things and I love little succulents. And um, so I got this one. This is not real, but it looks so real. Um, so I got that and then I got these little roses and I'm thinking I'm gonna put these to decorate with in our kitchen window. Um, I just thought those were really cute. And then I needed a utensil holder. Uh, right now I'm just using big quart size ball caning jars to put my utensils in. Um, and I have broken the bottom out of two of them on accident just by shoving the utensils down in. And I was like, this is $2.99. It's a little sturdier and it's a little bigger around. So I grabbed one of those. I got this coffee cup. I don't know if you can tell in the coloring. It looks the right color on my screen right now, but I don't know about your TV or screen that you're watching it on. But it's kind of like an iridescent purpley gray color. Anyway, I thought that was really pretty and it even picks up the colors in the succulent. Well, the problem with the little succulent is that these little things that they make it for kind of swallows it. So I just thought that that actually was kind of cute. So that's how I'm going to be using it in the little coffee cup. And then I love coffee cups and I just like the shape of this one and I broke a couple of mine over the past few months and so I just grabbed that because it was relatively cheap and I just like the shape of it. Um, I bought a two pack of these little bulbs because I wanted a little bit of extra light in our homeschool area. And they had these little lamps for just $6.99 that take these little LED bulbs. And so it gives it just a little extra light, like mood lighting, because it gets kind of dark in this corner here. I'll show you the difference. Okay, so you saw it with it on, and that's with it off. I just think it adds just a little something. Um, also, I can leave it on when I turn the light off downstairs and it can act kind of almost as a little night light. So, um, so there's that. And then we, we, even though we have a dishwasher, it is old and ancient and we still prefer to wash a lot of our dishes by hand. And Ikea has these for only $2.99. So I grabbed another one of those. In our kitchen, we have a huge window in our kitchen and um, I am having a hard time finding curtains that I like, especially that will go with the curtains that are in our den because our den is kind of connected to our eat it, or to our kitchen. It's not an eat-in kitchen. Anyway, um, and so my curtains in there are like a paisley print. Well, they have sort of this color in them. And so I saw these and I was like, oh, these might work. So, um, a two pack of their curtains. We love Ikea's curtains. I have their curtains in my dining room area. I also have their curtains in my daughter's room and these were only $24.99 and you got both of them. They're very good quality. Um, so I highly recommend Ikea's, um, Ikea's curtains. These, I don't know if you can tell, but they're just like a really light heathered, like, sagey green but it's almost got a minty color to it so I liked that that it kind of picked up on the green and the blue a little bit the last thing that I got besides this shelf that's sitting here the last thing that I got 
were these because these chairs, this used to be our um, dining table at our old house. These chairs are really, really hard. And so let's just go ahead and see if these are gonna work. I really liked how Ikea made them So they're attached. I just really liked how they were really, really strong Velcro. Um, and even though they don't look that fabulous with these chairs, they do kind of match the colors in those. And my walls are kind of a grayish color. And they really didn't have any other colors except a khaki. And I did not want to do light khaki with my kids. So we just picked these up. These were like $4.00 maybe five four ninety nine maybe I can't remember um but they're super cushy and they they the way they latch is really great they're not gonna come untied my kids aren't really gonna mess with them because it's really tight so we got those for their chairs I did not get one for my own chair but I'm thinking that I might get kind of a padded office chair anyway or I can just get over it and just sit on a hard chair. It doesn't bother me as much, but I want my kids to be able to focus on their schoolwork. So um, that's what I got at Ikea. And I hope you guys, I guess, enjoyed seeing my Ikea goodies when we get the shelf together. Um, I'll try to attach it at the end of this video where I will show you this shelf put together and everything on it just so you can see that space. So. Here is the shelf put together. It was only $19.99 for the shelf. And it's like super sturdy. And it comes with wall anchors, which was nice. Because it is pretty tall.